it's Jennifer and welcome to another day of 31 days of Halloween here on my channel if you are new and do not know what that is I am just doing a different Halloween look all 31 days in October I would love it if you guys would subscribe so you don't miss out on any of my future videos you can also give the video a big thumbs up down below and follow me on Instagram it's linked in the description box down below with a few other videos I think you might like from my channel so you can tell by the title already I don't know what I'm calling it yet. Glitter Queen. We kind of have a tiara happening. Not a tiara, like a crown almost. I don't know. This was so much fun to create, okay? This was so fun to do. I didn't know where this was headed when I started to film, but I am happy with how it ended. I think this is so cool. Um, Forewarning, some of the glitter I used was not meant to be around the eye area, like this chunky star and moon glitter that is in my hair, across my forehead, and on my cheeks and nose a little bit, also on my lips. Um, that is super chunky and it's meant for your hair and body. I got it on Amazon, so just beware. And the two glitter shades I used from these ColourPop palettes are also not safe for around your eye area. It's just from where it's super chunky. It could get into your eye, cut shit up. Nobody wants that. That will definitely put a damper on your th spooky bitch season. So just like beware. I'm going to stop rambling and get off of here. I'm going to go take a shower <laughs> for sure. Um, please make sure you give this video a big thumbs up down below and subscribe to my channel if you are excited for the rest of 31 days of Halloween and spooky bitch season. Okay, it's gonna be fun. We're gonna start off by applying some primer, foundation, concealer, powder, contour, and all of that. I got sick of paling myself out a little bit more, so now I'm using a foundation that's a little bit too dark for me, but it's all good. So now I'm going to go in with some highlighter and we are going to go super heavy handed. I'm taking the white out of this palette. I'm going to highlight my cheekbones, nose, over my eyebrows, my cupid's bow, a little bit on my chin. Just go crazy with your highlighter. Next, I'm just dipping into my James Charles palette for some neutral brown shades and I'm just building a smoky eye, deepening my outer corner and then we're going to get into the fun stuff. This is the start of fun stuff. I'm going into the Jeffree Star palette from Morphe and taking the solid gold glitter and pressing that onto the inner portion of my eye. Pretty heavy handed. This is going to be super glittery and shimmery and pretty. Once you're content with the amount of glitter on your eyelid, we're going to do a quick winged eyeliner. And of course, we're gonna add some mascara. Oh, I'm sorry, I also added those deeper brown shades. Um, I smudged them out on my lower lash line. And then we're gonna add mascara, top and bottom. Taking a creamy white pencil, I am just going to start laying out the shapes I want on my face. I'm putting down a white base to make the pigment show a little bit better. I'm adding a few little shapes coming down from my mouth. These don't have to be any certain shape or size, you just kind of want to squiggle some lines in. I'm also doing this under my eyes to make it look like I am crying. Right now it looks like I'm crying white, but don't worry, you fix it. And 
and I also add some coming out of my nostrils. Yeah, I don't know why. Next, I'm going to lay down colors over all of this white. I'm using orange, purple, hot pink, and yellow. I couldn't remember the last color, SARS. So once you get done laying down all of your color, we're going to go back over it with the coordinating glitter. You can do this with whatever colors and glitter you have, but I have a lot of glitter and a lot of eyeshadows. I'm also going in with some glitter liquid liner from Urban Decay and just adding a few more little lines and shapes coming down, kind of highlighting over some of my old ones. Just going crazy with some glitter. I wanted this to be a super bright, fun look because most of my Halloween looks I've had to pale myself out and we're using lots of dark colors. So for our lip today, I'm going in with a bright purple liquid lipstick from Wet n Wild. I'm also going back with that glitter liner and highlighting my cupid's bow pretty intense. And then of course to add some more glitter and shimmer, I'm highlighting my inner corners and under my brow bone. Not under my brow bone, on my brow bone. What is wrong with me? Alright, and here comes the super fun part. So my hair is super greasy and gross and I have to wash it anyway. So I'm giving myself a center part and I'm going to put on some gloves. You don't really need to use gloves if you're actually wearing this out because, you know, you're going to get glitty, glittery, glitter everywhere no matter what you do. Now I'm just taking some of this hair and body glitter gel and look how freaking pretty it is. It gets better when I smear it out. I'm applying this all over my hair, pretty much in the front and at my part, and I twist back two pieces in the front and pin them toward the back of my hair. Look how cool this is! I want you guys to know I've already taken a shower and I still have glitter everywhere. I also added quite a bit of this glitter to my forehead, some on my cheeks, and a few pieces onto my nose. I kind of want it to look like I was encrusted in glitter on my forehead there. Being super careful with my gloves and that's pretty much it for the whole look. Do we like it? How do we feel about this? Um, not where I saw it going but I'm happy it ended here. And try to make sure I don't get a hunk of glitter in my eyeball or in my lip, in my lip, in my teeth. So this is queen of glitter. We kind of have a little bit of a crown going. Our hair is glittery. I kind of dig it. Our entire face is glittery. Our eyes are glittery. We're crying glitter. We're throwing up glitter. Once you know, my entire room is covered in glitter, not even from the face, just from 
doing my hair. Uh, yeah, that was messier than I anticipated, but it's totally, it's totally fun. I'm living my best life over here. Just L-I-V-I-N, living. This is so freaking fun. It is super messy. Um, I would wait for the gel I used. I got it on Amazon. I would wait for it to completely dry before you like go frolicking around. But if you do decide to do this for some reason. Ooh, that felt gross. If you do decide to do this for Halloween, know you're going to get glitter everywhere. Like, there's no, there's no avoiding it. You're going to get glitter everywhere. I waited for my hair to be extra greasy and gross because I don't wash my hair that often and today is hair washing day, so we decided to do this on hair washing day so I could go hop in the shower. Yeah. So this was super fun. If you guys enjoyed the video, please give it a big thumbs up down below and subscribe to my channel for more spooky shit all 31 days of October. I will see you all tomorrow. Bye guys.